Perfect. All right. Now it is time for our sixth star. I might point out this is our last performance before we have a short break. Now, Mark Sargent, name ring a bell? <laughs> He, of course, was a Knights legend. He was once captain of the team and he was the club's first Australian representative. Since leaving football, he has got a PhD. He has his own company in research and business development. Now, I don't know whether they were taking the mickey when they decided what Mark would be doing, what dance style. Believe it or not, it's cheerleader. Let's watch Mark in rehearsal with his dance partner. Mark Sargent. Newcastle Knights. Well done, Mark Sargent! Oh, well, that was, well, I don't know if stunning's a word. Stunning, stunning in a, a sense, anyway. Now, big fella, uh, the night's called. Because we're live streaming this, they want you back. <laughs> um, that's the same sort of perverted logic that landed me here. It's not going to happen. <laughs> I didn't say to play. Uh, you know, you're on the sideline with the girls. Oh, sorry about that, Mark. It just, it just goes from bad to worse. It'll deck me. Now, Nicole, when you heard you were working with Mark Sargent, 
What did you think he'd be able to do? Oh, God, next to nothing. <laughs> <laughs> the most graceful one. <laughs> I think that summed up the performance beautifully. Oh, no, 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 it was brilliant. Over to the judges. Um, Steve, what did you think? Oh, my God. I, I grew up watching this man. Front rower, one of my idols, heroes. And you still are, mate. That was brave, courageous effort, and you were fantastic together. Tegan? Yeah, Sarge, they set you up big time with that genre. I would have thrown the pom-poms in their face, but you were hilarious. I loved it. Great job. <laughs> and Tracy? Yeah, thanks, Mark, for taking that on. You, you nailed it, and I just think you were awesome. As we all did. Now, if you would like to make your way out to the green room and have a chat with Mikey. Now, you have to love the Sarge, honestly. If you would like to vote for him in the People's Choice Award, go and drop some money in the Mark Sargent jar at the back of the room up at the fundraising station, or text his name through to the number on your screen right now and make a donation in his name. Now, as I said, we will be taking a short break um, after basically we get the judges scores and uh, perfect time to go up and buy your raffles tickets and make um, any sort of donation you would like to the Cancer Council. Thanks Kim. Come, in, uh, come and sit down Sarge. Well, I think we've just confirmed what everyone's thought about you mate. You've got big pink pom-poms. <laughs> and you yeah. showed them on stage tonight. Well I tried to keep them under control but you know. Yeah. I, Round of applause for Sarge, that was great. Now, I've got to ask Nicole, at any time during the rehearsal process were you frightened he was going to break you? <laughs> at first, a little bit, but he's a very strong man. And I taught him how to put me down gracefully towards the end there, so we've come a long way. You didn't think you were in here gracefully as a description of me, did you? Or oh, 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 the word put me down. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, mate. Well done, it's a great cause. You, you, you actually nailed it out there tonight. But was that as physically demanding as you thought it was going to be? Uh, it's interesting, actually. There's a lot more to it. The first, after the first uh, practice session, I went home and said to my wife, that's actually quite hard. But um, in, a, in, a, in, a, in, a, in terms of comfort zones, put me in the middle of a, in a, in the middle of a footy field any time. And Nicole, now that it's over and done with it, you're not dancing again tonight, are you? No, not again tonight. So champagne for me. And a skewy for you, mate? And it's good night from him. And it's good night from him. <laughs> okay. Well done, guys. We need, to, we, we need some scores from the judges. Stick around. Over to you, Steve. Okay, Steve, what'd you think? What'd you give him? Uh, here it is. Sorry, it's still a mic problem. Mark, uh, it kills me to do this, but if you would have waxed your legs, worn a skirt, you would have gotten an eight, but I'm giving you a seven. Oh, boo. <laughs> Tegan, what did you give, Mark? Gutsy and good job, Sarge. Yay! First ten. That's our first ten for the evening. Oh, well done. Tracy, what did you score, Mark Sargent? Uh, the journey was phenomenal. Nine. Yay! Well done, mate. Well done. I'm uh, not sure if that puts you in front. However, again, if you would like to vote for Mark in the People's Choice Award, go and put some money in the jar at the fundraising station.